Hi guys. In this video, we are going to see about Indian Patent Act, Section 10. Let's go and watch. Hello, this is IP Draw. How can we help you? Hello, I'm John, and I'm an inventor. I want to file my invention in Indian Patent Office. But I don't know, what are the contents, shooting specifications. Could you explain this? Don't worry. We will support you. Thank you so much. Shall I come to office, to discuss about the same? Sure, you are always welcome. So, now we are going to see about, the contents of specifications under Section 10. By using the below acts and rules, what content should be in specifications? As per Section 1 of 10, whether provisional specification or complete specification should describe the invention and its title, which indicating the subject matter of the invention. As per Section 2 of 10, if the controller requires the drawing, whether it is complete or provisional specification, to understand the invention in clearly, then the applicant should provide any drawing relatively describe the invention. As per section 3 of 10, sometimes controller wants to submit the prototype or model of the invention for clear understanding. At that time, the applicant should submit the samples to the controller before the date of grant of patent and that prototype is not considered as part of specification. As per section 4 of 10, Every complete specification should follow the four sections, as per section 4A of 10, complete specification fully and particularly describes the operation of the invention or use in its method. As per section 4B of 10, an applicant should disclose the which party has been protected in the claim of invention and an applicant should disclose the best method of performing of an invention. As per section 4, C, of 10, applicant should define the scope of invention, which is protected in invention, in the end of claim of complete specification. As per section 4, D, of 10, submit abstract of complete specification, which include, technical information of an invention. The controller, may, amend the abstract for better understanding, of an invention to the third parties. Then, if the applicant mentions a biological material in the specification, which is not mentioned in filed specification, then the application will be completed by depositing the material to an international depository authority under the Budapest Treaty and by fulfilling the following conditions. First one, material should be deposited not later than the date of filing the patent application in India. Second one, all the available characteristics of the material including name, address of the depository and date, number of the deposit of material should be submitted. Then third one, access to the material in the depository institution only after the application date of patent in India or if a priority is claimed after the date of the priority. And fourth one, applicants should disclose the source and geographical origin of the biological material in the specification. As per section 4A of 10, the international application filed as designating India, then the title, description, drawing, claim of the application shall be considered as a complete specification. As per section 5 of 10, claims of a complete specification relate to a single invention or a group of inventions linked to form a single inventive should be clear and be based on the matter disclosed in the specification. As per section 6 of 10, declaration of inventorship should be submitted with complete specification in the prescribed form and prescribed time. As per section 7 of 10, if the complete specification includes additional or development claims, which is not in provisional application, then the applicant should file separate application for a patent. Hi all. We are IP Draw. We are providing service in patent fields such as patent searching, patent draft,
patent drawing and patent filing. If you need any support, contact us on mail, that is, support at ipdraw.in. We are also active in social media such as LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram. And also contact us on WhatsApp number 995212 Thank you.